An underwater recovery team found the body of Osaid Habib just around one o'clock this morning, and RCMP say they have been searching around the clock. They say his body was found fairly close to the spot where he slipped, and conditions around Sturgeon Falls are very challenging with rapids and strong currents, so the divers didn't even go in. First responders instead used sonar and a remotely operated vehicle to recover the boy's body. Standing by had been the boy's family. We spoke to his father, Denisha Habib, yesterday. We were just camping in a Newtme campground. We hiked over here. We just came over here. I was sitting down on the bench uh, with my youngest son so I can lock his stroller. And my one son with uh, his cousin, they went over there. I asked them, I shouted them, come back. It's very slippery. He just went there and as soon as I turned to after telling my oldest one, I heard the scream and I turned towards him and he was just slipping over there. My whole family was here, everybody saw him drowning and we, we couldn't do anything for him. He was very helpful for everyone, everyone like him, not just uh, his parents or brothers, uh, uh, his uncles, aunts, cousins, nephews, even like we had uh, last month we had Ramadan, the whole Ramadan he did the volunteer in the community masjid. Uh, after the prayers, he was collecting donation for the for the masjid every night when we were going there for the prayers. And he was very helpful and sweet boy. Even if he had pain or anything in his legs or anything, he just comes and help for everyone. Osaid Habib was a student at St. Norbert Immersion School and a funeral announcement from the Manitoba Islamic Society where he helped out says he'll be sadly missed. Emily Brass, CBC News, Winnipeg.